Green Tunic Gaming! Yeah! Welcome back to the Green Tunic Hotline. Let's see who our first caller is today. It's probably your dad. Oh, Sean! <laughs> You're I, so good at this! I mean, you don't have any cute ladies calling you or anything, so I, I just took a wild guess. And your Ugh. mom's pretty neglectful, to be quite honest with no, you. No! I don't want to take a break, Dad. Yeah, she hasn't talked to us lately. At least Dad calls. At least she doesn't take your fucking money, like, freaking mom and Pokemon Gold. Yeah. You have the choice to give it to her, and yeah. she spends it on some nice things Dude, sometimes. Dude, she is so frivolous with her expenditures. I'm like, yeah, Mom, I need a fucking life-size Snorlax. It's exactly <laughs> what I fucking needed, thanks. Dude, that was, like, the best fucking thing. Yeah, I, I forgot what comic it was, but she's... <laughs> Like, you call your mom's like, hey, have you been saving my money? And she's like, yeah, I've been saving it, of course. It's like her at, like, Chippendale's, like, putting money in a guy's thong. Like, yeah, I've been using it wisely. I'm just like, oh, my oh, God. mom. She's investing in a future father for you. Yeah, yeah. It's true. I guess the only one we have a dad is Ruby and Sapphire. Yes, that is correct. Ooh, just, they never got a pops. Nope. Which is a bit odd. It's because they want you to be your own man. They don't want you to have to go off of the... Or or woman. Or woman. This is true. You can be a woman. Man, there would be a lot of enemies in this fight. Look at that frog! Dude, I love that derping ass frog. Have we seen that frog before? No, this is the first time. Okay, good. Because I was like, he's too cute to forget. So I like how the farm zombies have a tan. <laughs> it's slightly more brown than the last zombies. But Dude. The urban zombies. Yeah. We fought last <laughs> oh, time. Oh, right. I forgot about those urban zombies. Yeah. If they only got an economic chance, you know, if there's some sort of parody, I'm sure those urban zombies could I thought I make about as much on average as those suburban zombies. I think we already had that conversation. We did. <laughs> Twice, in fact. Did we really? No, it was just one time. Oh, okay. I wouldn't be surprised at this point. Well, maybe if you included the conversation we were having just then, it was twice. Hey! So yeah. There you go. I made you not a liar. I do appreciate that greatly. I don't like to lie. I mean, I like to lie down. Uh, do you ever... Is that, the, is that the proper term for that? Is it lie down? Yeah. That's... And you lay down a towel? Yeah, exactly, okay. right? So it's like, if someone says I'm gonna go lay down, and what are you gonna do? Go lay down an egg? You freaking turkey? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, boom, got him. <laughs> Grammar <laughs> served, and I walk out to all my friends. It's okay. I totally have. Somebody, gave, somebody at work gave me shit today, because, you know, I use the word delicious in as a descriptor in places where it should not be. Would you call, like, that seance delicious or something like that? or Yeah, essentially. Okay. Where, where it's just like, a, you know, somebody's like, hey, you know... I just did this, it was really cool. I'm like, ah, fucking delicious. Yeah. Or something. Just, I use it in place of like, ah, very good. Yeah. Or like, yeah, that's great. And uh, somebody at work fucking called me out on it. He said, like, that's not how you use the word. And without skipping a beat, I told him that, um, oh God, what was the exact response? Um, oh no. It was, his lexicon is constrained by the common use of societal norms. I'm sure he felt like a big old dingleberry after that. Yeah. Well, he yeah. sure as hell shut the fuck up. Dude. And my right. boss is like, I'm proud of you for using big words, Patrick. And I'm like, thanks, Rick. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> and then he called me a fucking douche. And yeah, it was, it was a good day at the office. I'm sure, I'm sure you're feeling pretty good about it. <laughs> I never, I never got how people got confused between illusion and illusion. You know? Why, when you say it like that, it's pretty clear. You're Ill talking about illusion, illusion. Well, illusion, allusion. Yeah, there you go. It's just like, yeah. I, I never got that. I would see that, like, mistake sometimes, and I'm just like, how? Well, they're not even close to the same thing. Like, there, there, and there. I'm like, oh, okay. And by the way, the your and your, alright? Yeah. There's. I Like, I get that, but we're forgetting the last your. Yester your. Y O R E. No one ever freaking recognizes old your. Oh, no, that's fair. Right? Yeah, it, no. It's all about Y O U R and Y O U apostrophe R E. But Y O R E just gets fucking left hanging, dog. And I think that's bullshit. I think we need to lobby for old your because, you know, aren't all yours created equal, Patrick? Fuck no. Is your your not the same as someone else's your? No. Really? Really? I. I, I find that hard to believe, Patrick. Okay, well, if you're going to bring up... you are being duplicitous. If you're going to bring up your... Can I bring up fair? 
As in, the fair to go to the fair was rather fair? Yeah, what's, what's, what's the problem with fair? Just, you know, nobody ever talks about the fair these days. They always say, let's go to the circus or the carnival. Well, I mean, there aren't too many of those around these days because those people are nomads, Patrick. Ad- additionally, nobody ever says, yes, hello, I would like to pay the fare for this movie. Well, they yeah, just want to buy the tickets. Yeah, because we don't live in the 1920s <laughs> anymore, Patrick. You saw that. Freaking, it's the same thing for your yard, your, your Y-O-R-E. Open up that bulletproof glass that they put the freaking teller behind and slap you across the face real quick, all right? Oh, my God. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's all right, though. Yeah. That's something my biggest grammatical like problem is when people go to use an ellipses to like represent a pause or just like oh uh, like well, we know or, like yeah and yeah, no, I brought this up to you or just like you know when they're like oh yeah also I think I did that plus. dot 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 did I that definitely happened well because they used two dots those bastards yeah <laughs> it's an angry cockroach dude that cockroach looks like you're on his lawn right now and he's like you crazy kids get off of that <laughs> he reminds me of um. The weird ass cockroach from Courage Cat the Dog. And that oh, one really like Yeah, that was uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, dude. I Don't look in the box. Dude, I know, right? Don't it was so the... uncomfortable. I thought he was gonna stab me. Like he's just like freaking thug ass fucking cockroach, <laughs> man. I was like, this dude's shady as hell. Don't look in the box. No Take you I... to this address. Don't look at the box. And it wasn't he inside this like hotel thing or something like that? Yeah, yeah. And he opens the door and there's the chick playing violin and all of a sudden it's like the real scary face. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck that. Let's get a cheat. I'm using a child. We're at one of my favorite places in this game now. Where I, I haven't been paying attention. Oh, really? Yeah. Walking to the Mr. Saturn Village. Oh, shit, son. We feel groove. Oh, I thought he said we feed groove, but we feel groove makes Not sense. Nah, dog. Hi ho, me, Mr. Saturn. This place, all are Mr. Saturn. Interesting. Welcome to Mr. Saturn, where they put gift boxes. Didn't they get rid of these in Smash 4? No, I think they're still there. They just get rid of the fans. Oh my god, the fan's not there. Yeah, which is bullshit. I get it because, like, that fan was cheap as fuck. But at the same point, why would you put Space Invader in? Space Invader's cheap as fuck also. It's just like an insta-kill. Kind of bullshit. I think you could... Oh, nice. Damn. Nice. That's dope. Dude, you're packing some heat, man. Thank God you're in fucking Eagle Land. You can carry that shit without a license. Right? Okay. Right? Fuck those fucking background checks and waiting periods. Those Magnum air guns. Know what I'm saying? It's our right as an Eagle Landian. Alright? We don't want people from freaking Team Crumpets Land housed in our homes. We need to stand in militia. Alright? Help! Somebody help! <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh man, so many rants lately. I... The, the 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 debates getting your your rabbles roused, dude. My rabbles are so roused; they are rocking, bro. It is terrible. Like I I've uh... oh, what is that guy spitting out of his mouth there? Is oh, that's... that a guy? No, that, that's a that's your ATM machine. Oh, it looks just like them. That's like if we made ATM machines that were just people. Yeah. And they spit money out through their mouth. <laughs> That's what the equivalent of that is. I, I'm saying we should do that. That's like if our tables were all people on all fours. That's what that's like. Oh, man. Ooh, alright, we got oh, some stuff to buy. Dude, okay, alright. Freaking shopping for women's always the worst, because you never know what to get them. Am I right, fellas? Fellas out there, are you are you feeling me on that? Am I right? Okay. I'm not nah, dog. I just buy bed something from Fire or Fallout. Well, I'm sorry that your flowchart is so simple, Patrick. Dude, I don't know why. Dude, freaking what? my gift giving flowchart is like the fucking flowchart for the ending of Mass Effect Two. All right. <laughs> I mean, that shit is all over the place. Bev, put up that flowchart. Oh my god. Thank you, Bev. If you put that up, if you didn't put that up, then. I feel a bit silly now. As well you should, sir. As well you should. Uh, so I can't help but notice you spent all your monies. Yeah, I did. I'm spending it to keep her alive. What? What do the What do the Saturns need with your money? Honestly, they seem fairly self-sufficient. You know, I imagine that they function off of some sort of barter system. Um, perhaps I'm incorrect. 
maybe my understanding of microeconomics of Saturn land is perhaps skewed. Dude, yep. the world revolves around money. Duh. Everything needs money. Not, psh, not the Saturns, homie. They got all they oh, want. God, I get so they got their shit. weird Saturn-shaped tables and their Saturn-shaped ATMs. Although, for some reason, why are their telephones up so high? I don't know, man. <laughs> like, that's a ladder next to the phone, right? Yeah. All right. In in the uh, in the the inn here, like where you can sleep and stuff, which are kind of to let you stay for free, by the way. Yeah. Um. But uh, yeah, that phone's on top of a ladder. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh. So in order to call the phone, you gotta climb the ladder. It's uh. It's a bit odd. I want to sell shit to you. Does that mean that they can't make phone calls? Uh, I assume... That, well, I mean, if they're able to climb a ladder... But... I think they could... I mean, looking the at their, like... Their biology here, it doesn't seem like they can climb ladders easily. Have you tried climbing a ladder without hands? I can't say that I have, but I'm not a Mr. Saturn. Man, you should give it a shot. It's life-changing. I, that 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 that's just not, that doesn't answer the question, Patrick. You, you, you're <laughs> deflecting, sir. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> At least once an episode. Uh, I am deflecting. For I believe that they can. I believe that these small creatures have built these wonderful buildings without any arms or yeah. really any gripping tools other than their feet. Patrick, can you can you look me in the eyes and honestly say that? <laughs> yeah. I couldn't even get a word out. <laughs> oh gosh, dude, these guys are master architects. Okay, really? so hopefully on the next episode of Green Tuned Gaming, we'll do more than just run the shop. Yeah, I noticed that's uh, that's all we did. Aren't all yours created equal, Patrick? Fuck no. Is your your not the same as someone else's your? No, really, really.